There could be anything living inside of this mysterious sewer. And I'm gonna be exploring it to see what crazy stuff we could pull out of it. To do that, we're gonna be placing these fish traps in there and leaving them for 24 hours. That way, if there's something in here, we're gonna catch it. But it's not just this sewer we're gonna be exploring today. There's actually four different sewers at this spot. And each one has their own crazy fish inside of them. And that's why I brought a bunch of different fish traps with me so we could place one in each sewer. We're gonna be placing a fish trap in this one. And we're also gonna be placing a fish trap in this really small sewer. But because it's so small, I had to go and make this tiny little fish trap. And we're also gonna be placing a fish trap in this sewer, but I'm gonna need a much bigger fish trap. The scary part about this one is it's 30 feet deep in there. So there could literally be anything inside. And the fourth and final sewer is right here behind me. And this one is known for having monster fish inside of it. But before we place these traps, I brought a bunch of nets and we're gonna use these first to see what we can catch. We're gonna start right here with the smallest sewer. So we got a little tiny net and we have a bucket full of water here. So here we go. Let's just stick our net in there and see what we can catch. Oh God. I do not want to stick my hand in there. Oh, this is so scary. Oh my God, my net's not long enough. That means I'm going to have to stick my arm in the nasty water. Oh Jesus, this is so nasty. Oh my God, I got a fish already. Look at that. It's a little tilapia. Well guys, we caught our first fish out of the sewer today, but it's just a tilapia. We don't want this guy. So we're going to throw him back into the sewer. See ya buddy. We're after the crazy fish today. So let's get back in there. I literally have to stick my arm in there in order to reach the bottom where these fish probably are. Oh God, it smells so bad in there. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, that's a big fish. Look at this, you guys. We got something big. Oh, no, it's another tilapia. You got to be kidding me. This is a spotted tilapia. They're a little cooler, but still, it's not what we're after. So we're just going to toss this guy back in there. See you, buddy. Oh, my God. What is that? Ew. I caught a freaking alien already. Look at that thing. What the heck is this? That looks like a freaking alien, you guys. If you know what that is, let me know in the comments. But ew. Ew, it started moving. <laughs> Ow, oh, I just touched something with my hand. Oh, we got a fish though. Look at that. Oh my God, it's a baby Oscar. Yes, our first cool fish of the day. That's a little baby Oscar. He's got really pretty colors too. So we're definitely keeping this guy. There he goes into the keeper bucket. All right, first cool fish of the day. Let's keep it going and see if we can catch any more. We've murked up the sewer a lot. Look how dirty the water is now. We have no clue what could be inside of here. <laughs> oh, that was a good scoop. Yes, look at that. That's a giant sun catfish. Look how pretty this fish is you guys that is insane okay we're gonna get him in the bucket before he jumps away all right let's get back in there oh something big something big. Oh, yes we got it oh my god look at that we got two fish in that net wait three fish no freaking way what a net check this out you guys we got a little baby spotted tilapia we'll throw him back we got a little baby blue tilapia that might be the same one as the other one but this guy is an exotic and we're definitely taking him home that right there is an oscar a lot bigger than the baby we just caught so this could be the parent to that one well guys we're catching fish in the sewer but it's a little more difficult than usual and that's because we've had so much rain and the water level is a lot higher so i can't actually reach the bottom so we might have to rely on our tiny fish trap to catch some fish out of here but for now we're gonna keep on netting and see what else we can catch oh, we're going around the whole thing come on oh my god what is that oh no way oh no we got out no we just lost that you saw that fish it was so colorful i have no idea what that was you guys if you saw it comment down below but we're gonna keep trying to catch it we gotta find out what that is oh god look at the size of that fish oh it's just a tilapia though that's a big tilapia what the heck are you doing in there buddy all right we don't want you now the amount of fish that we already pulled out of the sewer was crazy and some of you guys might be wondering how the fish even got in the sewer if you look right here on the sewer grate it says drains to waterways so basically what that means is this directly connects to like a canal or somewhere and the fish in the canal can swim up into the sewer and then they become trapped in there oh look right there there's a fish on top Come here. Should I get him? Oh my God, it's another tilapia. Ugh, I better not get a disease from this. That was the best scoop yet. That was really good. What the? Oh my. Wait, what the heck is this? What on earth are you? What the heck? I've never seen this fish before in my whole life. Oh, that's so crazy looking. Oh my God. You guys, look at this fish we just pulled out of the sewer. That is a literal alien. I have no idea what this is. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. We have to keep them. That is actually insane. You guys, we're going to need your help identifying this fish that we just caught. Look at that. That is actually crazy looking. Look at this. No, ew. <laughs> like what? So we'll throw them in the bucket. And I guess we're going to give it a few more nets in this sewer. See if we can catch any more fish oh what the heck what is the, ew wait what what on earth did we just catch it's like stuck to something down there you guys if you know what that is let me know oh do you see that 
Oh, we got him. Wait, we just got two fish right there. Look at that, guys. We just caught two more fish in that net. A little tilapia. We'll throw him back. But this guy, that right there is, I think, a Jack Dempsey. Yeah, that's definitely a Jack Dempsey. One of my favorite cichlids to catch. These guys are beautiful. So that is really cool, guys. We're going to add them to the keeper bucket. Look at this haul we got going so far. We got like five fish in there, including one mystery fish. That I have no idea what it is. So yeah, this is a really good start, guys. But we have three other sewers we're going to be fishing today. So we're going to move on now and start netting around in the second sewer. But before we do that, we're going to bait up our fish trap and we're going to send it on down there. All right, there goes some good old cat food. Now we don't need a lot. This trap isn't that big. And then we just send it down. Look, I just saw a fish right next to it. And there it goes, you guys. There goes our first fish trap. We're going to grab a longer net because the next sewer we're going to fish is a lot deeper. All right, we're at the next sewer and there is a bunch of fish in there. I can actually see them already. You guys, there could be something crazy in here. And if there is, we're going to catch it. So we're just going to stick our net in here, guys. It's super deep. I don't even know if this is long enough. Oh my God. Look right here. Is that a baby turtle? It is a turtle. I got you. Oh my God. That is so cool, guys. We just got a little baby turtle. So right now he's in the area where it floods. When we get a lot of rain, this sewer overflows. And then all the water gets washed out here. And along with the water, we got turtles and fish. But that's really cool, guys. I don't know if we're going to keep them. I don't know the laws on turtles. I don't even know what kind this is. So we're going to let him go. See a little dude. Oh, there he goes. You know what, guys? If there's a turtle in here, there might be some other crazy stuff. So, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Helen, Helen, watch out. Oh. It's flooding right oh now. My oh my God. This is what I was talking about, guys. The water is so high that all the water comes gushing out. Look at this. Should I take a net? I mean, maybe this is like the prime time. All the fish are coming through the sewer right now. Let's take our net in there and see if we can catch any fish. This is crazy. This is really scary. There could like be a gator that comes up through this. Oh God, it's so heavy. Oh, we got a crawfish. Look at this. Oh, that's not a normal one either. That's one of the colorful ones. Guys, this area is loaded with colorful crawfish. Ow! Oh my God, he just pinched the crap out of me. Look at my finger right now. He just pierced my skin. Oh, he's about to escape. Right there is a colorful crawfish, guys. You can see he's got really pretty blue claws. Oh my God, relax. That is a really cool one. I've never seen one like this, actually. He's got purple. We're gonna keep this guy, throw him in the bucket. But as you can see, the water's calmed down now. It stopped overflowing. I don't know what that means, but it could definitely mean that it's bringing more fish and more crawfish into this area. So we might catch something crazy. We're gonna add him to the keeper bucket. There we go, we got a crawfish. Let's keep going and see what else we can catch. I'm telling you guys, I don't think my net is long enough to reach the bottom in here. That's how deep it is. That is really scary. Yeah, look at this. But guess what? I can actually make this net even longer. I just got to unscrew this part. Look at this. <laughs> it just doubled in length. <laughs> All right, so this was the end of the net before. Let's see if we can reach the bottom now. Oh, we reached the bottom. Oh God, it is so, oh, there's our net. Oh my gosh. Look at that. There's so much mud in there. Oh, there's a fish right here. Look at this guy. We got something. Another tilapia, nothing crazy, but that's really cool, guys. We have a net now that is long enough to reach the bottom of the sewer that is crazy there goes our tilapia see you buddy oh what is that look right here what the heck is that oh that's something cool whoa i have no idea what that is if you do let me know in the comments but we're definitely gonna add him to the keeper bucket and take him home later oh unless he escapes okay let's just get him in the bucket all right there he goes look at our army right now we have so many fish in there we're going back in i'm gonna try and net on this back left side now because if there's fish in there they're probably by the corners oh yeah there we go that was a good net oh Oh my God, <laughs> okay? I almost just fell in there. That would have been bad. Oh, it's stuck. Oh, there it is. There's our net, come on. More mud, okay. Mud's actually a good sign. That means we reached the bottom. So we might've caught something. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, he grabbed. There's a freaking clown knife fish in there too. Okay, we got a little gar. Okay, get out of here. Get out of here. We don't want you. But look right here, you guys. Oh, that is so cool. That right there is a little baby clown knife fish. We've caught these here before, but that is a really nice one. All right, there's another fish added to the bucket. Let's get back in there, you guys. There's gotta be something big down there. Oh, there's bubbles. Come on, please tell me we got something. I don't see anything in this net. We took a few more nets in the sewer, but we kept coming up with nothing. It seems as if all the fish in the sewer have disappeared, but I had an idea. What I think we should do now, guys, is wait for this thing to overflow again because when it did that it brought all the fish in this area as well i don't know when it's gonna do it again but i think we're gonna camp out here and hopefully it brings in a bunch more fish oh oh my goodness yes it's happening finally okay we have to take advantage of this moment now and try to catch as many fish as possible all the fish right now are being brought in from a creek or a canal i don't know what to do this is crazy ah, give me my fish please oh no it stopped come on oh no it's going down it's stopping you guys we oh my god we got two fish right there you guys we literally waited here for like 30 minutes for it to happen again and it only lasts like 20 seconds but look we caught two fish out of it what the heck is this oh my god whoa look at this thing it has giant teeth oh my gosh look at the ow it just pierced my skin that is one crazy looking fish i have no idea what that is ow 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 oh my god ow 
Ow, 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 ow. Is he biting you? He's biting me right now. He's biting me. He literally has me so good right now. He won't let go. Ow, ow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at that. Are you okay? No. Why is everything biting me right now? I have no idea what that is, but that's crazy looking. But look at this. We got another fish in here. Oh my god, it's another spotted tilapia. Okay. Nothing crazy there. We'll let him go. But we did catch one cool fish out of that. And I have no idea what it is, but it has massive teeth and it's very aggressive. Look at that. It kind of looks like a gar, but gar with like crazy teeth. Okay, guys, we're gonna do a couple more nets right here. Since that thing flooded again, it might have brought more fish into this area. We're gonna see if we can catch a few more. All right, here we go. We're going in for another scoop. We go all the way down and then we pull it up. That's simple. Let's see if we got anything. Oh, we got a lot of mud in that one. That's oh, holy crap, there's something red. Look at this. What are you? Oh my god, yes! That's a giant Oscar. So pretty too. Look at the red colors on them. That's a gorgeous Oscar. I think we got something else in here too. What is that? Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. This is probably the same one all three times. Get out of here, dude. We don't want you. In you go, buddy. Look at that. We got two big Oscars, one baby Oscar. We got a little Oscar army in here. All right, guys. Well, it's becoming too hard to catch the fish in the sewer with the net. So right here, I got one of our fish traps and we're going to go ahead and bait it up and send it down there. And we're going to leave it here for a full 24 hours. And I'm really excited about this one because if this thing keeps overflowing like that it's gonna constantly be bringing in more fish and we should be able to catch a bunch in our fish trap here we go we got the whole tilapia flag going in Ew. oh god i just got the juices all over my leg look at this god i'm gonna throw up oh Oh, it smells so bad. Oh. Well, you know what that means. If it's stinky, the fish are gonna love it. Let's go ahead and set our fish trap into the sewer. All right, guys, so our rope is actually not long enough to reach the bottom, but that's perfectly fine. All we gotta do is we just make a loop right around the sewer grate and we tie a knot so our fish trap is not going anywhere. Boom, just like that. So now, guys, that means we have two fish traps set and we have two sewers left to fish. And the third one we're gonna be fishing is the one that is flooded right now. You probably can't even see it, but watch my net disappear. Right there is the opening and there it goes this one's pretty deep as well not as deep as the other one but definitely deep oh yeah oh 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 god oh my are you okay i almost fell in that one too all right well let's see if we caught anything in that net oh my no way first freaking net you guys we caught something crazy that is a black ghost knife we've caught these here before as well that is a really big one. Oh my gosh what a way to start off this sewer but that's really cool guys i'm gonna grab the keeper bucket and we're gonna get him into it that is sick look how cool that fish is guys these fish actually swim backwards look there he goes <laughs> oh that is so cool oh, oh my god I almost fell into it again. What is going on? This is one scary sewer because the water's so murky now you can't even see the opening. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Oh my God. A Mayan cichlid. That's not what we want. Get back in there. We caught a piece of trash. There's a bottle in there. We're going to throw that away, guys. Don't litter. All right, let's... Ah! Oh my God, how am I doing this every time? I'm just going to stay on the bank for this one. I'm, I'm not going anywhere near that sewer grate again. Ah, come on, give me something good. Oh, what is that? Whoa, what is that? What? is that that's another freaking alien fish you guys i have no clue what that is i've never seen this before in my whole life what the heck did we just get that is so crazy guys it kind of actually you know what it kind of looks like the other fish that we caught they kind of look similar don't they like their fins and their tails that's so crazy guys no idea what either of them are if you do comment down below that's super cool though another fish that i've never caught out of this sewer so we're gonna get back in there do a few more nets and see if we can catch any more fish here we go I swear I'm not doing this on purpose, guys. Okay, I'm done. I'm just gonna grab a fish trap right now and we're gonna send it down there. If I keep netting around, I'm gonna wound up in the sewer as well. <laughs> All right, guys, we got the fish trap baited up. I think this one's gonna catch a lot of fish. There's a lot down there. There it goes, right down there. And right here's our rope. We're gonna attach it to this so we don't lose our trap. And there we go, it's not going nowhere. And now, guys, the fourth and final sewer we're gonna be fishing today, we're gonna need this crowbar in order to open it. Now, this is super heavy, so hopefully this works. Three, two, one. Oh, God, oh my gosh, we did it, we got it open. Oh, God, look how murky the water is this time. Last time, it was really clear in here, so we could actually see in there a little bit, but now we cannot see a single thing, so now it's really a big mystery. Now, guys, we discovered this sewer last time we filmed at this spot, and we caught some crazy fish in there, so I'm really excited to stick the net in there, stick our fish trap in there, and who knows what we're gonna catch out of it. Oh, my gosh, this is so scary. Oh, my God, looks like I'm gonna have to extend the net. It's super deep in there. Oh, we reached the bottom look at that from my left hand all the way to the end of the net that's how deep that sewer is that is really scary there could be anything living in there so let's see if we can catch them okay oh my gosh this one is very hard to fish oh oh, oh my god 
Yes! We actually caught something. I think it's just the tilapia. But I'm actually really excited. We actually caught something out there. We're gonna toss the tilapia back and hopefully we catch something crazier next time. All right, here we go, guys. We're going in again. We caught that last fish on this side. I'm gonna try on this side, see if anything's over here. Oh my God, it's literally so deep in there. Oh, I see our net. Oh, there it is. Oh my God, what is that? Look at this. Oh, it's stuck on the tree. Let go. Oh my gosh. We got something in here. Look. A baby Pleco. <laughs> that is not a normal one either. Look at the dots on him. Oh my gosh. Look how crazy that is. It feels different too. Look, it's got like spikes all the way down its body. That's a crazy looking Pleco. If you guys know what kind this is, let me know in the comments, but we're going to keep him. There he goes. No way. Look right here. Is that a knife? Oh my gosh. What the heck? That looks like a black ghost knife, but it's like brown colored. I've never seen that before. Look at this guys. This is a black ghost knife fish. And this is the one we just caught. You can see they look very similar, but this one's just got different colors. Coloration. That's crazy. I've never seen that before. We're definitely going to keep them. So there they go. You guys, there is some crazy stuff in the sewer. So let's stick the net in there a couple more times. And then we're going to bait up the fourth and final fish trap. Send it on down there. And guys, we're going to come back here in a full day. Check all four fish traps. And I'm sure we're going to catch a ton of crazy fish. So here we go. Let's see if we can get any more with the net. We kept on netting, but we weren't catching anything. And it was really frustrating because I could actually see the fish in the sewer. You guys, I just bought a bunch of fish in the back left corner. I'm going to try and catch them. It's been a struggle in here though they're so fast come on oh yes we got one of them look it's a hopeful oh we got two actually yes we got them you guys it's been so hard we've been netting here for like 10 minutes and we see a bunch of fish in there with the light but as soon as i go for them with the net they just swim off but look we got two of them there that's a big convict cichlid and this right here i think is a yeah that's a hopelow catfish that's two really cool aquarium fish we're gonna add them to the bucket look at this look at the hole we got going so far you guys i mean we got handfuls and handfuls of fish including a bunch of fish that i've never even seen before and I'd love to keep going. However, the sun is going down and we need to get this fourth and final fish trap into the sewer. So let's go ahead and bait it up. All right, guys, check it out. So since the sewer is so deep and I don't have a rope long enough, we actually have a fishing rod right here and we have it tied to our fish trap. So here we go. Let's get the bait in there. Got a nice piece of tilapia. All right, there it goes. This looks really good, you guys. This is a brand new fish trap. So I guess we're gonna find out if it works well or not. Here we go, let's send it on down. We're gonna put it right in the middle and there it goes. Oh my gosh. Look, it's still going. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think we just hit bottom. All right, you guys, the fourth and final fish trap is set. This is insane. I cannot wait to come back here tomorrow and see what we call so we will see you guys in 24 hours and as i set my rod up and i started packing up my stuff this happened what the hell helen helen what oh my god oh my god what the hell wait where did the rod go what just happened helen oh my god what happened i don't i don't know wait the camera's still the camera's still rolling something just dragged the fishing rod in there i think what just happened? I was getting, I was picking up the stuff and I heard the rod like fall into the sewer. How would that happen? The whole rod? Yeah. I'm so confused right now. This was recording. Okay. I'm going to watch back the footage on this. I think we just got that. All right, guys. Well, we just watched back the footage on the GoPro. And after I set the rod down and I was going to pick up the stuff, we were packing up for the night. Something literally dragged the rod into the sewer. I don't know how that would happen. The rod was over there and the reel was over there. I have no idea what just happened. It was literally like some paranormal stuff right there. A freaking ghost did it or something. I don't know. What if something down there grabbed it and like ran off with it, you know? Unless we believe in ghosts. That's the <laughs> only option, really. But I want to find out what it is, okay? We have to now. So I actually have my monster fish traps with me i wasn't planning on using them today but i think we're gonna have to so hopefully it doesn't get taken all right there it goes into the trap all i have was this line so we went ahead and tied it to the fish trap we're gonna send it down i don't want to lose another trap tonight all right there it goes look at that that is a perfect fit get it oh, <laughs> there it goes look oh my gosh that's so scary it literally just keeps going oh my gosh let's put the let's put the line right here okay well i guess we got the monster fish trap in there and clearly there's something monster down there that just stole our fish trap so now guys we're gonna see you in 24 hours and hopefully nothing took this fish trap but we do have a bucket full of fish that we caught already and we're gonna head back to my house now and get them into my backyard ponds and my fish tanks all right guys we've made it back to my house and we got the bucket full of keepers and we're starting things off here at the mystery pond and we're gonna add this hope little catfish in this little baby oscar here there they go and now we're here at the mini pond and we got a bunch of fish we're gonna add to this one including these knife fish i know this is a black ghost knife but i have no idea what this one is 
So there they go, into the pond. And then we also have these two mystery fish. I have no idea what they are. Oh, there goes one. But we're gonna add them to the mini pond. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. It looks like a freaking dolphin. And now we're here in the fish room and we got a couple little guys we're gonna add to one of the new tanks. We got this Playco. I have no idea what it is. Comment down below. And then we got a little baby clown knife fish. We're gonna put him in this new fish tank. There they go. That clown knife fish is gonna get massive. And one day, he's gonna join the predator pond. But we got a couple more fish and we're gonna go ahead and add them to the quarantine pond. And there they go. We got a couple Oscars, got a couple little catfish, and that's all the fish that we caught so far. But we have four fish traps that are going to be marinating there for a full day, and I cannot wait to see what we catch. So we'll see you guys in 24 hours. All right, guys, it is the next day, and it's been 24 hours since we placed all four fish traps. And we're back here right now, and we're going to see what we caught. And I think we're going to start things off here with the smallest fish trap. Oh wait, I can actually see the fish trap. Oh my God, no, the fish trap's floating right now. I don't know if that's good or bad, but here we go. Oh, there we go. Oh God, it smells bad in here right now. Oh, I see it. What the heck? It smells so bad. Why is our fish trap floating? Ew, we got a nest. Wait, oh my, no way. Oh my God, the fish trap is jam packed right now. Holy crap, I see like four different fish in there. What the heck, is, is that a puffer fish? The trap is freaking loaded. I don't know what's happening. But we have a bucket right here with clean water. We're gonna go ahead and empty it out and see what we caught inside. Look at that, we're just gonna pop it open and we're gonna pour it out. It's, oh my God, look at that. That is a little puffer fish. What the heck? I don't think we've ever caught a puffer here. And we also got another little baby Oscar. That is so cool. All right, there's two fish. But there was more in here I saw. Look, is that an eel? That's a baby eel, look! That's a, no way, that's a fire eel. Holy cow, look how cool that is. That's like the smallest fire eel I've ever seen. Oh, there he goes. Anyone else? I think that might be it. Oh, wait, oh my, oh, yes! What the heck is that? Is that a baby snakehead? What, oh wait, oh, dude, that might be one of the baby big mouth sleepers. Oh my gosh, if so, that is a really cool fish, you guys. We're gonna go ahead and add him to the bucket. We caught four fish out of that trap. That's actually insane. And every single one of them is something cool that we're gonna bring back to my house. Wow, what a way to kick off the night, guys. The smallest fish trap caught four keeper fish. What is going on? All right, we're gonna pop the lid back on and we're gonna move on to the second fish trap and see what we caught in that one. Okay, guys, we are here at the second sewer fish trap and that is this one, the super deep one. And I see a rope right there, so that's a good sign. That means our fish trap is still there, and hopefully we caught ourselves a lot of fish. So let's find out. Here we go. We got our rope. Oh, this is so scary. What the heck? Oh my god, it's stuck. The fish trap's stuck. It's not moving. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, I got it. Oh, it's coming up. Oh, there it is right here. Look, I got the trap. Oh my gosh. Look at all the fish in there. Wait, we caught so many. Yes. Oh, this is so cool. Okay. Let's unzip it and find out what they are. Oh my gosh, right off the bat, I see two big clown eye fish. This is the smaller one. Wow, look how pretty he is. Way prettier than the little one we caught yesterday. There he goes. And this is the second one. Oh my gosh, this one is so big. Look at the size of that one. Holy crap. Big gar in here. We need to get you out of here, buddy. You're going back in the sewer. Oh my God, a Mayan cichlid? No, two Mayan cichlids. We're gonna throw those guys back. Look at that, a tilapia. You've gotta be kidding me. We didn't place a fish trap in here for 24 hours for Mayan cichlids and tilapia. We did place it in here for this though. Look at that green terror. Holy crap, that's the biggest one I've ever seen. Oh, look at the size of this plate off here. What are you doing, buddy? You guys, this fish trap was literally loaded with fish. This is so cool. And we got a couple more in here. What is that? I think this is a Jack Dempsey, yep. Another Jack Dempsey, but we got one more fish in there and it looks like some sort of catfish. What is that? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, he's going crazy. He's going crazy. What the heck is that? You guys, it looks like a walking catfish at first glance, but I've caught a lot of walking catfish in my days and that is definitely not what that is. Walking catfish don't have that fin right there. What the heck is this? I have no idea, but we're gonna keep them. Yeah, that's not a walking catfish, you guys. If you know what it is, let me know in the comments. And yeah, that is it for the fish trap. Oh. Never mind. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. We caught one of these yesterday too. We're going to keep them. See you, guy. Look at the keeper bucket from two fish traps, you guys. That is insane. And we have two more to go. So let's head over to the third one. And here we are at the third fish trap. Can't see it because the water's super murky, but it should be somewhere down there. And here we go. We're going to pull it up. Okay. I can feel the trap. It's not stuck on anything. Where is it? Oh, there it is right there. I see a fish. What is that? Oh my. Oh. 
Dude, this trap is loaded too, you guys. 24 hour fish traps, okay? If you wanna catch a bunch of fish, leave your traps there a full day. Oh my gosh, this thing is jam packed. I'll buy the flingos too, yes. I was hoping we would catch some, guys. We caught these here before. Oh my gosh, that is a beautiful Playco. Here's another one. We'll get him out. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at these things. Get out of here. Go back in the sewer. All right, another tilapia. That's amazing. That's exactly what we want. What the heck? What is... Oh my gosh. You guys, look at this Playco. It kind of looks like the one we caught yesterday, that small one, but just a lot bigger. We'll definitely keep him. Oh, I think that might be a chocolate cichlid. Look at this cichlid. Holy crap. That thing is huge. Look at that. Got a little Cynodontus there. Beautiful. We love Cynodontus. And we saved the best for last, guys. Check it out. That right there is a tilapia. Woohoo! Yeah! We're gonna keep this guy. We'll put him in the keeper bucket. All right. Now it's time to check the fourth and final fish trap. Hopefully our fish trap is still there. Let's go check it out. All right, you guys, we're here at the fourth and final sewer and our fish trap should be somewhere in here. Hopefully something didn't take it. I got our line right here. Here, let me get him a little tug. Oh yeah, it's definitely on there. Oh, it's so heavy though. Hopefully the line doesn't break guys. We're gonna pull it up right now. Oh, I'm so nervous. This is our monster fish trap. So if we caught anything in it, it's going to be monster. Holy crap, something big is moving in there, Helen. You feel it? Yeah, I, my whole like hand is shaking right now from something moving in it. I'm so scared. Oh my, God. Oh, oh, dude, it just moved. There's the trap. What the, look, 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 look. There's a yellow fish in there. I got the trap. Yes. Holy crap. No way. What, something Helen. good? No, 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 something bad. You guys, am I seeing that right? Oh, I'm seeing it right for sure. What is it? I'll give you a hint. Our second to last video, we also caught one in a fish trap. An alligator? Yes, there's, I swear <laughs> to God. There's, Are you serious? Look, it's, oh, holy crap, it's right there. You see him, right? What the heck? There's some fish in there though. Oh, this is bad, you guys. Okay, I'm just gonna pull it up right now. There's a gator in the trap, okay? If you guys haven't watched my second last video, we spent 24 hours in a sewer. We also caught a gator in a fish trap at the end of that video. What is going on right now with the gators in the fish traps? It's so heavy, look at them. That one's bigger than the other one. It's like twice the size. Please be friendly. Oh my God, look at, oh Jesus. That is so scary, Helen. Honestly, I have no idea what to do right now. Oh my, no, 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 no. He's attacking the fish right now. Did you see that? He just took a bite no. out of that. No, 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 Okay, this is really bad. Helen, watch out. Okay, oh, he's pissed off. I'll be back. I'm gonna grab a knife. Oh my God. Oh, I can't believe it right now. Look, he's trying to bite another fish right now. We're gonna try and cut this trap open and hopefully he gets out of it. Looks like we gotta break another fish trap. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, there we go. I got it. Oh, okay, okay, get out. Please get out. The hole's that way, please get out. Oh, watch out, watch out. He's right by the hole. There he goes. Oh my gosh, yes. Look, oh my God. Yeah, get out of here, buddy. You guys, look at this. Oh my God, there he goes. Man, this one is freaking pissed off. What is with the gators and going in our fish traps lately? Look, there he is. That one's so much bigger. That's literally twice the size of the one from last video. There he goes. We gotta hurry back though, because there is a lot of fish in that fish trap and he actually attacked one of them. So hopefully we could save him. Oh my God, look, he's bleeding. I feel so bad for this thing. Come on, buddy, we're gonna save you. It looks like some sort of synodontus maybe. Look how pretty that fish is, you guys. But yeah, he definitely got bit by the gator there. There you go, buddy. Is he gonna swim? Oh, he's swimming. He's looking good. Look at this. Holy crap, that's a giant Texas cichlid. I don't think the gator bit him. We got two tilapia and a spotted tilapia. Oh my God. That was so crazy. <laughs> you know what I think now after catching the gator and knowing there was a gator in there, when we dropped the first trap down, he probably was going for the tilapia and he just took our trap and took off with it. Wow, mind blown. I thought we were gonna catch like a giant fish or something. For the rest of the fish, we're gonna get him back into the sewer. This is insane. We just caught an alligator in a fish trap. He better make it. That is like one of my favorite fish we caught out of the sewer here. He doesn't look too bad, like the damage. All right, cool, wow. Bucket full of keepers yet again, guys. Four fish traps, 24 hours, that was insane. Now we're gonna take them all back to my house and get them into my backyard ponds and my fish tanks. But if you want me to come back here to these sewers and place more fish traps for 24 hours, go down there and let me know. But for now, we'll see you guys back at my house. All right, guys, we've made it back to my house and we're in the fish room with my boy Happy, the puffer fish. And we got all the fish that we caught in the fish traps and we're gonna add some to the fish tanks. But right here, guys, we got a clown knife fish. We actually caught two. These guys are so pretty. And we're gonna go ahead and add them to this fish tank. There goes one and there goes the other. Oh my gosh, look at that. We got two clown knife fish. And we also got this really cool Playco. I have no idea what kind this is, but it's really cool looking. So we're also gonna add him to this fish tank. 
There you go, big guy. Comment down below what kind of Plinko that is. And right here, we got this mystery catfish. So I have no idea what it is, but we're gonna add him to this fish tank. There he goes. And I think I know what we're gonna do for this Synodontus. Right here behind me is a big empty 125. And we're gonna put him in here. This is gonna be his little home. Hopefully he can recover. And once he does, we can add him somewhere else. So we'll keep you guys updated. Hopefully he makes it. Comment down below a name for him too. And now guys, we're here at the Mystery Palm once again. And right here we have a little Synodontus. We got two albino Plecos. They're gonna get massive in here. So there they go, wow. Check it out guys, we got two really cool cichlids. This is a green tear, and this guy, I honestly, I got no idea what it is. We're gonna go ahead and add them to the Oscar army. See you guys. These are the last two fish we're gonna be adding. They're gonna go great in here. We got this little puffer fish. I don't know what kind it is, but he's really cool. And then we got a little baby fire eel. There they go. There goes the eel and there goes the puffer fish. Yes. But yeah, guys, that was crazy. If you did enjoy, please go down there and leave a like. Subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.